Elnur Abduraimov versus Manuel Correa. And by the way, I apologize if I'm mispronouncing your names. Uh, who do y'all think is going to win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video, it helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So this fight between uh, El Noor and Manuel Correa is scheduled for 8 rounds in the junior lightweight division to take place this weekend, this Saturday on the 7th of May in the undercard of the Saul Canelo Alvarez versus Dimitri Bivol fight over in Las Vegas, Nevada, USA. To be shown live on the zone the zone pay-per-view i'm not sure if this fight will be part of the pay-per-view card to be honest i know the zone tends to show free fights before the pay-per-view card so i i'm assuming this fight will be part of the free fights on the zone so just tune into the zone this weekend if you want to see this fight between elnor abduraimov and uh, manuel korea uh, before i talk about who i think will win to those who don't know who elnor abduraimov is 27 year old fighter from uzbekistan very good amateur background 8 and no as a professional, 7 wins coming by way of knockout or TKO. Coming up a win against John Jimino back in December of last year over in his home country of Uzbekistan. And now here he is in his ninth professional fight fighting a fellow undefeated prospect in Manuel Correa. A 31 year old fighter from Cuba, 11 wins, 0 losses, 7 wins coming by way of knockout or TKO. Uh, Correa is coming off a um, a majority decision win against Marcelo Williams back in February of this year and now here he is you know both fighters stepping up and fighting undefeated another undefeated fighter and uh, you know it's a very good test for both guys and based off what I've seen of both guys because uh, honestly I've never seen Manuel Correa fight before I've seen Elnur Abduraimov fight before because he, his fight was shown live on the zone uh, before uh, based on what I've seen of both guys, I'm thinking it's 60-40 in favor of Elnor Abduraimov. I like Korea's inside game. I think he has a very good inside game. Uh, but I'm favoring Elnor's uh, outside game, uh, fighting in range, fighting from the outside. Because of his ability to move from one side to the other, his ability to find different angles. It's that footwork I feel like will be the big um, will be the big difference in this fight. It's Abduraimov's ability to find different angles inside that ring uh, different spots moving to one side or the other it's going to be that footwork i think is key to victory for elnor abduraimov but if korea can go on the inside work the body early on you know work uh, to start to break down the body early on we have ourselves an interesting fight i'm not counting out korea because i think he definitely has a chance to pull it off here but i'm leaning towards abduraimov winning a close competitive fight it's held for eight rounds so i think we'll most likely go the distance with the Abduraimov maybe winning, um, let's say five rounds to three, I, I think it's going to be close and competitive. Um, it's going to be close and competitive. I won't be surprised if Korea wins. I'll say that much. Uh, but I'm leaning towards El Noor. Um, honestly, just looking forward to a great weekend of boxing again. Just tune into the zone, and you should be able to see this fight. It's going to be one of the early fights, by the way. So keep that in mind. So. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. Can't wait. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.